Hey YouTube, it is France Leaved and I'm sorry for the glare coming in and out. Um, I know this is not ideal and it's not aesthetically pleasing, but this is the only time I have to make videos. So I hope you guys can deal with it as I deal with it as well. Um, so this is my week 34 update and I try to do something a little bit different this week. Um, I'm already three days behind for this coming week, so we'll see how it continues. But um, I'm going to show you my little week in review. I made little snippets. The thought was to make a snippet every night. Uh, it didn't quite happen that way, but this is what I did make. Enjoy, and I'll be right back. Hey YouTube, it's France Lee. So today is Tuesday, and I was thinking about it last night um, with all the things and how my week goes up and down. And I want to try to do like these weeks in review when I upload my weekly video. Um, hold on. That's a clavicle. Yeah, sorry. Had to totally interrupt that. Okay. So week in review. That's a clavicle. All right, I'll stop. Look, so pretty. Okay. But, okay, one last time. All right, so I know this isn't aesthetically pleasing, but look at how the shadow. It's a clavicle. All right, I'll stop. Okay. So I wanted to do this week in review with my clavicle and um because everything kind of gets crazy and then by the time friday comes i don't really remember everything that's happened so first of all let me um apologize this is not aesthetically pleasing it's all very yellow i don't know why my kitchen is so dark but it is uh you can see the doggy no that's the baby that right there is that's raylan there she goes and my dog is over here um and there's my keurig waiting for my 30 minutes because i'm gonna have a cup of coffee but anyway, um, so today's Tuesday. So I think I uploaded my video Saturday. Sunday, um, went out with the husband and Emily. We had a great time. And then yesterday was Monday. Um, yesterday was okay. There's We have a little bit of family stuff going on right now. Not sure why. But um, I obviously can't handle the, anxiety, the feelings that it brings because... Last night, I sat in here and literally ate probably six saltine crackers um, with butter, and I couldn't stop. It was like the constant. Um, today's Tuesday. I had all intention of starting the day out great. Um, I made my coffee. I ran to work. I did what I had to do for my sub. I um, made some snacks. I went to get sushi at lunch with my coworkers. I took off the rice. I only ate the inside. I came home, and... I have sat here for the last 15 minutes eating saltine crackers. So obviously that is, it's going to have to be a no-go. And I have realized that my trigger is if people aren't talking and there's no communication and I don't know what to say to get things started and when there's tension, I can't deal, especially when I have to live here. So there's tension right now. Um, We'll see how it goes, and hopefully by Friday, this video will have gotten uplifted. Um, see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. It is Thursday, but this is actually the clip that I should have left yesterday for Wednesday. So I thought I'd do it real early in the morning. Um, I'm on my way to work, so I am going to make it quick. Um, so <clears throat> I taught all day yesterday. I got to work late, of course. I woke up super late yesterday. It was awful. But um. I got home and I can't buy saltine crackers anymore. I did the same thing, I sat there and ate. Um, I'm also journaling this because I'm realizing that when I get home from work, I think that um, all the stressors of home life weigh on me and it's almost like I get home from work and it's entering back into reality. So um, <clears throat> while there wasn't as much tension yesterday, I realized that I probably do need to have a conversation with um, with my stepdaughter and I'm avoiding it just as much as she is but it needs to happen unfortunately my husband will take care of it because he's just as non-confrontational as she is <laughs> so she has to get it from somewhere right um, not knocking them but it is what it is and so that puts a lot of strain and um, I can't use food as a crutch um, on a different note I have an appointment with a therapist on December 15th and I'm super excited. Um, so I'll definitely keep you posted on how that goes, but it's not until the 15th. So I will update you later, but this is for Wednesday. Um, see you guys later. Hey, so it's still um, Thursday and I had to make a 
fast clip, a couple of things. So first of all, my six o'clock tutoring has canceled and um, I don't have an excuse to not go to the gym, but um, I find myself looking for excuses why I don't want to go. Um, I need to find a pair of shoes. I want to go get some makeup. The eyebrows are coming out better. I need to practice. <laughs> um, and the other thing I noticed is I haven't logged my food all day. I don't know what the hell is wrong with me. Um, I started the week out awesome. Like I logged my food on Monday and then I went to that meeting on Tuesday where I was gone from school all day and I logged the morning, but because, and I even logged the sushi, the sushi that I ate, but for whatever reason, I don't know if it's because I sat in my kitchen and ate all of those crackers or something, but I didn't log the rest of the day. And then I didn't log at all yesterday. And I just realized that I have not logged since Tuesday morning. So these are the kind of like the stupid shit that happens during the week and then i wonder like what happened how come by the time weigh in day comes i don't lose appropriately well it's because i'm not holding myself accountable until like thursday <laughs> yeah so um i want to go to the gym i will clip again to see if that actually happened but i really like this keeping me accountable it's helping me um i hope you guys like it too oh and um i haven't drank water all day What's up with that? Um, it's like, so I drink one bottle of water while I'm getting ready and I do that to be, I guess, in the positive with the water since water, I don't know how it is for everybody else, but it's like super challenging for me to get all my water in. But tell me why I haven't drank water all day. I literally, I left the house and I was like, crap, I didn't drink my bottle of water while I was getting ready. I drank my coffee and then um, went to work had lunch, never drank water, came back, no, I ate a snack, left, came back, had lunch, never drank water, got another coffee, still haven't drank water, and had another snack. Yeah. That, what? Come on, Francie, get it together. So, as you saw from my little week in review, um, it was an up and down week. Um, there were a couple of days where there was a lot of tension in the house and then it got better and then I was super excited because you could see my clavicle. And it turns out that Thursday, I did not make it to the gym. I went shopping. So um, let me give you my stats and let's see what week we're on. So I had vertical sleeve gastrectomy on April 6th, 2017. Um, my at Cary, uh, wow, at Wake Med Cary, and my doc, my surgeon is Dr. Bruce with Bariatric Specialist of North Carolina. My highest recorded weight is 270. My surgery weight after one week um, pre-op diet was 253 and a half. And when I came at you last week, it was week 33, and I was two, no, one, whoo, Wonderland, 189.6. And this week I am 186.6. So I've lost three pounds since last week. Um, was I at a stall? I don't think so. I think that my weight the last month was pretty representative of how I've been doing. Um, I was, there were, t there were weeks when I looked back that I didn't log like I normally do. So, you know, I think that it was fair. Um, I was very strict. I got a little bit back on track. I'm doing really well with my water, except for that one day when I hadn't drank water. I don't know what's wrong with me. I did make up for it. Um, I ended up drinking like four um, water bottles when I got home that evening. But um, so I think it's a good representative representation. Um, I lost 5.4 pounds in the month of November, which is not a lot. We shall see where I'm at for the month of December. I've got my goal of um, 180. I, I don't know, you know, I don't know. Um, the weight is, has definitely slowed down. It's always been slow. Now it's even slower, but I'm okay with that. Now, if you watch past videos, I haven't been okay with it. So I'm a, I am okay with it now. Um, so that's it. Um, I will try to do these weekend reviews cause they were fun and, and it was actually fun to look back and kind of see, where I was at and where I was feeling too. So it was good to document it. Um, so anyway, I hope you guys have a great week and I will see you next week. Bye YouTube.